welcome to Grand Quiz Auto, the quiz that separates the spark plugs from the crankcases. And here are your presenters, Elisa Portelli and Wayne Kershaw. <laughs> Come on, more louder. <laughs> yeah, oh, Sarah, well, come on, we've only just got here, just about, because Wayne drove us into work today, and everyone knows what his driving's like, Well, so we might drive it. I suppose you'd prefer it if I had my blindfold on. Yeah, what do you mean, preferred it? You did have your blindfold on, didn't you? No, I just had my eyes closed here. Yeah. Useless, absolutely useless. Well, without further ado, let's find out who our contestants are this week. Well, this week, Neil is from Durham and drives a Golf, but would really like a Ferrari 360. Neil's a kart racer, but has his sights to become technical director of Formula One. Jody is from Wakefield and drives a Corolla GT, but has sights on a 550 Maranello. He's another kart lover and has Formula Ford experience too, and wants to get into the world of aerodynamics. Leo is also an experienced Formula Ford racer, but has the shame of owning a Fiesta diesel. But he's determined to drive a McLaren F1 one day when he is a top professional racing driver. And Elisa and Wayne, they are your contestants for tonight. Well, first game today, <laughs> wasn't that fantastic? Let me, I will have a go. Yeah, I will have a go at that. Hang on. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> well, our first game tonight is called Bits and Pieces. And here we show little pieces of a car before revealing it in full. Points are awarded for the first to buzz in with what car we are looking at. Well, what are we doing? You Wayne? get five points? points, guys, if you're real quick. And it just goes down and down and down to one point. So three, three pitches. That's three pitches. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and of those Good. three pitches, you get a chance of five points. That's 15 points there for the asking. So get your fingers on the buzzer. Go for it. Right, are you ready? OK, no, ready. let's take a look at car number one. The quicker you buzz in, the more points you get. Well, we're not very revving now. with the buttons here. Come on, guys. Are we not going to have a guess now for three points? Are you down to two points? They're too cool, Wayne. They are, aren't they? I just One don't think now. they know, to be honest. Surely. No, Jody. BMW. Oh, uh, what, sorry? BMW. Yeah, but what type? Five. Series? Uh, Estate? Oh, yeah! yeah. Can you know <laughs> and he's, for that? Eventually BSC. he's got there. We'll <laughs> give you a one point for that. OK, then. Keep your fingers on the buttons. <laughs> His cart number two. Now, the back lights of a car are normally a big giveaway, guys. Come on. I must admit, I don't know it. Any offers? Any guesses? No. Go on. No ideas at all? It'd be all right if it was a Formula One car, I'm sure oh, you'd get it Oh, well, easily. I'll tell you what it is, then. It's a Subaru Justy. No, didn't have well, an idea. Yeah, I thought it was a Subaru. Oh, well, they you <laughs> should have pushed your buzzer layer, you know? All <coughs> right, here we go. This is the last one. Here's car number three. Four points. You're going to get this one. You're going to kick yourself. I bet, you, I bet you're itching for some clues, aren't you? Well, itch as much yeah, as you like, because yeah, we're not you're giving not you one. <laughs> <laughs> no? Go on, have a wild guess, somebody, just for one point. Neil. Neil. Suzuki Jimny. A Suzuki? Jimny. No, it's a Suzuki Grand Vitara. Got the brand. Oh, Give me that. Never mind, never oh, mind. Man. Bit pathetic there, but there you what go, guys. <laughs> right, let's go over to our feet and find out what the scores are. Well, Neil and Leo are having a few mechanical problems with their brains, but flooring it with one point, it's Jody. Well, Jodie may be flooring it, but it's now time for Round the Bend, and this is where our contestant gets a chance to guide a blindfolded Wayne around a video driving course. Now, first up is Neil. Now, adopt your position, Wayne, please. I think I might adopt the crash position, because <laughs> the way I've been performing with this, there's every chance I'm going to crash. I know, I know. Show everybody your trick with your helmet thing. Go on, put it on. Right, then, here you go. go <laughs> <on>. <laughs> it's a family show. Here's my helmet. Do you think that looks fetching? <laughs> eh? Do you think you look like a Formula One driver? <laughs> yeah? This is a... You look so dashing. <laughs> there you go, look at that, eh? Yeah. There Especially you go. decorated that helmet. Right, come on, we better move on. We're being told we've got to move on. Oh, take the notice of him, I do. Right then, here we go. Put your blindfold on now. Listen, That's Neil, ready. you're going to tell him left, right, forward, and so on, okay? You have to shout at him, he's a bit deaf. Okay. Right? Okay, after three, two, one, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Accelerate. Go on, son, give it some. I am, son, I am. Go son. on, give it some. go on. We've got a right hand turn here. Go on, right, right, right. Easy left, left, left. Ooh. Floor it left. Left. Go the wrong way, Wayne. Left, Wayne. 
Oh, left. you have to go oh. back. Behave yourself. Okay, go okay. right now. Right. Go on. Forward, forward, straight, straight, straight. Left. Left, left, just a touch. Left, just a touch. Go on. Too much. Go right. Go right. Come on, we can do better than this, son. Oh, right, here we go. We're going round left. Left, that's straight, left, left, that's right. Come oh. on, Wayne, left and right. Oh, you mean left? Left. Left. <laughs> left, Wayne. Right, how are right. we fixed? Go now? left, just a left. Left. Right, straight up. Right, Wayne. <laughs> Come on, Wayne. Right and. You're out of time. You just have a tendency <laughs> to hit those. Oh, dear those me. Those I'm sorry. All the time, don't I you? do apologise. Actually, your instructions were really good, Neil, but you were talking with a very strange accent. Well, that makes Not two of us fault. win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't, I didn't think that wasn't too bad, but let's go over to Pete and see what he thinks. Yeah, not bad at all, really. Uh, we're going to uh, test the skills of all three of you and we'll give the uh, scores later on. Well, now we play Show Is Your Badge, and in this game, Wayne will show the contestants vehicle badges and they have to guess which manufacturer they are from. Are you ready? <laughs> like three wise monkeys, these, aren't they? Look at them. Wise, right. wise monkeys. Go on. Yes, all right then. Here we go, guys. Get your fingers on the buzzers. Here we go. Neil. Citroen. It is a Citroen. Oh, we've got to catch him out on something at least. How about that one? Leo. Vauxhall. It is Vauxhall. Will you get this one, though? This is difficult. Leo. Now you wish you'd never buzzed ah. in now, don't you? <laughs> huh? Uh, I'm going to go for Vauxhall again. It isn't, my friend. It's Di Tommaso. Mm -hmm. Tasty bit of exotic here. You've got to get this one, guys. Neil? Audi. Oh, sorry, no. What is it? Can anybody else offer? You say it is. It is, Jody. It is. One point for you. Here we go. Jody? Yeah, everyone Fiat. knows this. Yes. Now then, this is a few options, I must admit. Jody? Yeah. Before your time, I reckon. Neil, Neil, go for one point. Austin. It is an Austin. Nice one. Here we go. Are you ready? Neil. For, for, for Leo. one point for this, Neil. Fiat. Fiat, it is. One you point get one. for Leo for that. And finally, Leo. Now you wish you'd never been again, Neil? Out, you know, Morris. Neil. Here's a Morris. One well point done. for Neil there. Excellent. Well done. Oh, Leo and Neil, sort of, oh, not quite sure. Yeah, they surprised me with some of the older cars. I didn't think you get the older cars, so you did surprise me. Well done. They didn't do too bad, did they? Well, Peter. Yes. Have you got the scores, my dear? Indeed, I have. Well, Jody's uh, still driving rather economically with two points, and then it's Leo with three, but in the lead at the moment, it's Neil with four points. Well done, Neil, but plenty of time for Jodie and Leo to catch up. OK, it's time now for our second contestant, Jodie, to drive Wayne around the bend. Wayne, get your blindfold on again, my son. Jodie, now, you saw what Neil did, so... Oh, I... <laughs> He's not really a very good driver, is he? <coughs> not Bless really. Him. Oh, it's but the blinking navigators, it's not the driver, for goodness sake. <laughs> God, he's cocky, isn't he? Right, left, right, forward and so on, OK? OK, OK. So, three, two, one, and go. Accelerate, son. Go on, lad. Go on. Easy right coming up. And turn right now. Right, right, <laughs> forward, forward. Left, left, left. Forward. Bit left, bit left. Forward. Bit right. Oh, forward. there's a wall again. <laughs> forward. Little right, little right. Go, Go on. on forward, forward. Left, left. Wayne, you're not doing too bad. Oh, I'm on, my son. Forward, left a bit, left. Right. Forward, left. Well done, JD. Forward, forward. A little bit right. Go on, left. Forward, right a little bit. Forward, <laughs> forward, forward. Go on, lad. A straight would be left, good. Left, left. <laughs> go on. <laughs> Where am I going? Left. left, go on, go on. Forward, forward. Time I hate. Not bad, Jody, at all. Have you done that before? <laughs> uh, never, actually, no. I mean, I, mean, I can't no. see what's going on. I assume the circuit doesn't go like that. It's just me that goes like that. <laughs> Definitely you. A hidden talent there. Jody, that's quite an unusual name, isn't it? Is it short it for is, anything? Yeah. Or? No, no. It's no. named after Jody Schechter. Oh, who's Jody Schechter. Now, you wouldn't know because it's before <laughs> your time, isn't it? But I remember Jody Schechter. I, I hate to admit this, I think I've even watched him on television. Really? Racing driver. Formula One racing driver. That's right. Was he world champion, he I asked? was. Was he? Yeah. When was that? Uh, around 1980. You get no points for that, but very good. Peter, <laughs> can you stop them from waffling and tell us what the scores are, please? Yes, maybe we should uh, change the name of this from the rally game to a three-point turn game or something. But anyway, no, not bad at all. And uh, Jody will uh, give you a score later on. <laughs> 
Well, we now come to our pit stop and we throw some general car knowledge questions at our contestants so they can fuel up with some vital points to see them into part two. You can now. earn a fair few points from this, but it's obviously how quick you are on the buzzer and how long we've got, how many questions we get in the time allotted. Mm -hmm. So first there gets the chance of earning the points. All right, you ready? Fingers on the buzzers? Yeah. Your time starts now. Which famous ex-racing driver recently sold his Formula One team to Ford, Neil? Jackie Stewart. Correct. Who founded Ferrari? Leo. Enzo Ferrari. Correct. What is the name of the British Grand Prix race circuit? Neil. Silverstone. Correct. When was the first motor race taken place, you know? First motor race. Is it around 1918? No, it's 19, uh, 1894 in France. In which country is the uh, Suzuka circuit? Japan. Jody. Correct. Uh, multiple choice here, which is the odd one out? Sterling Moss, Nigel Mansell or Damon Hill? No? It's Sterling Moss. Despite yeah, being the greatest race, <laughs> racing driver uh, to come from Brittany, he's never been the Formula One world champion. Uh, which manufacturer did Nigel Mansell never race for? Williams, Benetton or Lotus? Neil. Benetton. Correct. What are Vauxhall models known as on the continent? Neil? Opel. Correct. What size of engine is fitted to the MGF? Neil? 1.8. Correct. Woo! Right on the buzzer there, hey, boy. These guys know the stuff. <laughs> they are, I'm right, very they? impressed. Mm. Uh, they the definitely know the Formula One stuff. Yeah, they certainly do. Well, let's go to the voice from above and find out what the scores are so far. OK, well, Leo has got a sticky throttle with five points. Jody's still keeping his powder dry with six, but racing ahead towards the horizon, Neil with 14 points. Oh, a bit sore, that sticky throttle. You've got to get that sorted out, Leo. Never mind. Well, in part two of Grand Quiz Auto, Leo will get the chance to actually drive Wayne round the bend and we test their knowledge of the highway code. So don't go away, we'll see you in part two. Hello and welcome back to Elisa. Grand Quiz Auto. Elisa, what? let me tell you about me. I've got a new job, like, you know, road testing cars and te I'm a test driver. Right, yeah. And we're at the moment using new or different types of fuels, you know, because of the state of the, the situation with the global warming and everything else. Yeah. So just of recent, I've been given a new form of fuel and this is its old ship's timbers. And oh. at the moment, we're running on 46 miles to the galleon. <laughs> Do you know what? Look, look, I'm trying my best here. Yeah. You absolutely split my sides. You're getting too comfy sitting here next to me. You should be standing up. I don't know what's it like. Oh, now you are funny. Now, before we go into our video round, let's go over to Peter and find out what the scores are. So well, far. Leo and Jody still define their form. Leo's on five, Jody's on six. With racing ahead, Neil with 14 points. I love you really, Wayne. Well, back to the games now in Stop, Look and Listen and we'll play a video of a specific car. All they have to do is to pay attention to what we're going to say. You have to look and listen and I will tell you some questions, OK? And you've got to answer them afterwards. You Already? have indeed got potential of 12 points here, but you might have to wake me up when it's finished because this is the point where I have a little snooze. But OK. What do you mean? You always have a little snooze. Anyway, here we go. Look at the monitors. Let's roll the tape. To some, the launch of the new BMW was seen as a disappointment as the older model had some real differences to the 5. Now it looked as if the 3 Series was merely a scaled-down 5. But the fact remains that the package is as strong as ever, with solid, well-thought-out engineering delivering a superb driving experience. The prestige of the BMW badge plus a choice of engines from the 1.9-litre to the 2.8-litre, which offers a super-slick 0-60 to 60 time of 6.7 seconds, means that this car is on many a company car driver wish list. The 3 Series is now offered with Dynamic Stability Control, or DSC, which works through the traction control and anti-lock braking systems to help bring the car into line if you get into trouble. If you plump for the auto box option, you'll also have the benefit of BMW's Steptronic Semi-Automatic Shift, a great way to give the driver more control over the car. Oh, OK, guys, you ready? Fingers on the buzzers. Here we go. What is the 3 Series now offered with? Anybody? No? Too slow. It's the Dynamic Stability Control, yeah. wow. DSC. What other two devices does the DSC system work with? Leo. The ABS and Traction Control. Yep, correct. What else will you get with the uh, Automatic Box option? Any idea? Jody. Steptronic. 
Correct. What is the 0 to 60 time of the BMW, Leo? 6.7 seconds. Correct. What is the engine range of the 3 Series, Leo? 1.9 to 2.8. No. Anyone else for one point, uh, Jody? 1.8 to 2.9. No, it's... Uh, uh, Actually, it probably is 1.9 to 2.8. Yeah. You probably were right, Leo. It's written down here. I've got 2.9 right. on here. Um, <clears throat> name two other series in the BMW range. Jody. Five and three. Um, nope, Leo. Five and six. Nope, Leo. Five and seven. I'll let you have that because everyone else Five had to go. Because you had the three series already, didn't you? Yeah. See? So it was two other ones. OK, well done. Well, let's have a look and see what the, uh, the oh. scores are. Let's have an update, please, Pete. OK, Jody and Leo are trailing on nine, but still in the lead, it's Neil with 15 points. Well, how well do you know your highway code? Well, I don't know it at all. This is Pasture Test, the lovely Wayne. He's going to hold up road signs. And I'm going to ask some general knowledge questions as well. And all you have to do is get them right. OK? okay. All right, fingers on the buzzers. Wayne, you're going to go first. My turn first, is it? Now then, <clears throat> we want no smart comments about this first one. Here we go. Are you ready? Elderly people crossing? Oh, actually, sort of. It's frail elderly people. But I think you're right there with that one. Well done. OK, general knowledge questions here. Are you ready? How many days will you have to take your driving licence and insurance documents to a police station if you're requested by an officer, Leo? 14 days. No, nope. anyone else for one point? Jody? Seven. Seven days. Correct. Right, guys, you ready for this one? What's that? Uh, hump in the road. Well, it, it's Caution. actually a risk of grounding, Lying, but I think... Uh, Unnerving surface or hump in the road. That'll do for me. I reckon he gets one point for that. OK. <clears throat> what is the legal limit of a person's blood alcohol level whilst behind a wheel? Leo. It's not 30 millilitres per 100 millilitres, is it? Uh, <laughs> do you know what? I'm going to give you one point because it's 80 milligrams to 100 millilitres. So you got one right now. I'll give you one point. Here we go, guys. What's this? Yep. Uh, caution of cyclists. Yeah, sorry, I didn't see you like there, mate. Neil, what caution of cyclists. Well, close. It's actually a cycle route, and really, I don't think it's, it's there. It's a cycle route, is it? Yeah, cycle mm -hmm. route ahead. OK, last general knowledge question here. Approaching a zebra crossing, what is the first thing you must do? Slow Neil. down. Pardon? Slow down. Correct. Why? <laughs> because uh, you have to stop at a separate cost if there's someone... I just wanted to see if you knew it there, Neil. <laughs> OK? Oh, you evil woman. You're <laughs> so strict. And what's this one, guys? A raising bridge. Yeah, well, bridge ahead, swing bridge, or a raising bridge will do. Thank you. Well done. OK, well, Peter, do you have the scores so far? OK, well, Leo is still with 10, Jody's with 11, but my word, with his rev counter in the red, Neil's with 22 points. Now, with Wayne in position, our final <coughs> contestant, Leo, gets to see if he can do any better in Mound the Bend. Don't have your hopes up, well, though. Well, the skill's been slacking, so the enthusiasm's got to come through, isn't it? It certainly <laughs> has. Are you, are you referring again. to my skills here, then, Leo? Wayne, so, they're getting well, very cheeky, aren't they, these just contestants? Just a bit, yeah. enough, well, they're all bigger than me, so they're enough practice now. I'd expect you to do a little better for me. Ooh. All right, mate, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness me, right, I'll count you in. Are you both ready? OK. All right, three, two, one. Go! Go on, floor it. Give it some. That's it. OK, you've got a right hander coming up. Ready now, soft right. That's it, left, 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 left. That was soft. OK, reverse. <laughs> that was soft, it's just the way <laughs> I drive. OK, left, forward. Ooh. OK, you've got a little, little left coming up. No, not the right, the left. <laughs> <laughs> not dyslexic, are you? Yeah. <laughs> left a bit, left a bit. Right a bit. You're not doing bad though, Leo. Come on. Keep it going. Oh. That's it. Left a bit more. Left a bit more. Left a bit. Straight forward, right, right, right. Straight forward, left. Oh, you just like those walls. Right a bit. Right a bit. Go on, left a bit. Oh, you're out of time. That wasn't bad at all, Leo. Were you quite pleased with that? That was, that was quite good. I'm impressed with my driving. Oh, there. it's the first time she's <coughs> come. Thank you, Leo. I hope you As win. The, where are you from then, Leo? Where have you come from? I'm um, down near Brighton. Right, that's quite yeah. a way, isn't it? Yeah, it is hey, quite you'll a way. See, we have contestants all over the UK. Don't <laughs> there you go. 
very, very well done there anyway oh, on your thank last you. Round the Bend. Right, well, that's the end of Round the Bend, and we need to find out what Pete thinks. What order, first, second or third? Well, all three of you did very well, but in our challenge of testing co-driving skills, we're going to award two points to Neil, four for Jodie, and six for Leo, which means that 15 and 16 for Jodie and Leo, but still way ahead of the field, Neil with 24 points. Well, it's time now for our final game, Checkered Flag, and our contestants get more car knowledge questions. Fingers on the buzzers, guys. It's two <coughs> points for a correct answer and one for a Passover. Time starts now. What road links the Midlands to the West Country? Leo? M1. No, it's the M5. Too slow. What is the name of the lights at a pedestrian crossing? Neil? Uh, pass. No, Jodie? Pelican. No, it's a Belisha Beacon. What is the name of the famous Red London bus? No, it's Routemaster. Which Renault model replaced the five? Neil? Cleo. Correct. Name the VW Beetle model with denim upholstery. Anyone? No, it's Jeans. Who owns Seat? Neil? Fiat. No, anyone else? VW. Jody? Yeah, Volkswagen. What car was recalled after failing the so-called Elk test? Neil? Uh, it's uh, Air Class. Yeah, Sadie's A class. Well done. Which French car maker has introduced a keyless ignition system? Leo? Peugeot. No, anyone? Jodie? No, it was a Renault. Which motorcycle maker also makes musical instruments? Leo? No, you do! <laughs> it was Yamaha, by the way, if you wanted to know. Well, let's find out what the final scores are now from our wonderful Pete. Well, what an exciting game, but Jody and Leo there behind in 16, but past the chequered flag tonight, Neil with 28 points. Well done. Well done. Well, our losing contestants get goodie bags as well, while our winner goes on to our leaderboard to get the chance at appearing in our semi-finals. Have you all had a very good day, though? Have you oh, enjoyed well, yourself? Well, Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, congratulations, Neil. You go on to the semi-finals board. Well, we're going to be back again next week, aren't we, Wayne? Uh, I, I, I hope to be. I don't know whether you are. We'll see you then. Take care. Bye. <laughs>